Cleveland on the rocks. And Liza the Burby Bar, because I'm Matt. And that's Tony. And we're about to get into some Redwood Empire. Not just any Redwood Empire. This is the Super Blue Bottle. Lost Monarch. Wapow. Any of you guys know, you see a red bottle, you see a green bottle, you see a blue bottle. And they're all blends of like a bunch of crazy like different bourbons and whiskeys and ryes and this and that. And this one's got a whole ton of weird blended ones. You know what's blended in here, Tony? So I do know that it's a blend of four to 12 year old bourbons. Okay. And three to five year old rye whiskeys. Hell yeah, I'm done with that. So basically if this is gonna I'm, be like a super if, high rye. Yeah, yeah, I think I found that it's somewhere in the realm of like 85% rye. 85%, holy I, crap. Yeah. Okay. So. So, I mean, most of you guys, if you've watched our videos for a very long uh, time, from the first one, this bottle has been here through every video, and we've never opened it yet, because I was very stuck on the black cask version of this bottle, and I couldn't find it, but I bought this one because it was there, and I was waiting till I found the black one, and now I'm learning that I'm probably never going to find the black one again, and I've only ever tried it once, and yeah, so we're going to do the blue one, because I've got the blue one. Oh, and, and there's a Christmas one that comes out, we'll Ooh. definitely have that one if I can find it. So, see if this pops off pretty well here. Eh, it was okay. Hope okay. it tastes better than it popped. But okay. yeah. So I know I've been tending to like the rise lately. Me too. This is definitely probably the highest rye I've try gonna be trying. Right. So I'm kind of super excited. Oh, damn it. Yeah, you gave yourself a little less. That <laughs> now I'm way more. Yeah, Either good. way. It looks uh, good to me. I've been very I've been big into the rise. And the one rye that I am very, very looking forward to tasting is Angel's Envy Rye. Matt, when you come back, Angel's Envy Rye, I know you picked one up. I need to try that, because I feel like that's gonna be super good. So, you took a set of this already, so what do you got there on your uh, on your nose? Ooh, oh, that's different. It is. So basically this has a... I'm trying to pinpoint, because I'm definitely getting a few things. It almost smells like a like a baking vanilla, like the yeah. black baking vanilla that you put in cookies. I think I need to smell things more in right. life. I mean, you obviously get, this one's very high ethanol yeah. but once you get through there and you cut through it, it's uh, absolutely fantastic. <laughs> get, getting a little vanilla. Yeah, it's yeah. Very faint on the maple. Very different. Very, very hot. This is going to be hot forward. I feel it. I think so. You ready? I'm willing to back. This is going to be super good. Hot on down the hatch. Hell yeah. Oh, wow. So, wow. This know. one's really good. It coats your mouth very, very oh, well. Yeah. It's thick. Yeah, like butter I mean, in your look mouth. Look at the legs on this stuff, man. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah, it runs like, down the glass. Like from the rim oh. all the way down. It's very hot that, in the end. It's very, very hot in the I end. I don't know what it is about rise. Rise always hit me in my nose. This this didn't rye forward me though. I didn't get a rye forward in the front of your tongue type of thing going back. It didn't catch it like all the other rise I'm used to. So I don't this is very it's almost like a light rye, but this is supposed to be even higher rye than most of yeah, the rye that I have, so it's like right? unless in my research, I was looking at the wrong bottle. Wow, those legs run the entire glass. Yes. I know you can't see it on camera, but dude, crazy. This is good. I think this is going to have to go head to head with Masterson's. And we can even throw Blue Run. I was just going to say. Because the Blue Run is, was way hotter than this. But, but they're, they're very similar. Mm -hmm. I, I feel they're very similar. This is really good. I like this. Mm-hmm. Mmm. Got an idea. I think I'm gonna take so, one ice cube in here. Yeah, yeah, let's try that. Just one. So and those of you that have watched a lot of our videos. So back when we started, I was new to whiskeys and bourbons and you started talking about rice and mash bills and this and that. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Right. And based on the few, first few things I had, Matt, 
was like, I think you're going to like the rise. We weren't drinking any rise at all. I don't get very many rice. I don't buy rice and too often. Now, for the few I have had, Matt hit that nail on the freaking head because so far <laughs> I've been loving the rise. I'm the I'm the big drinker of the group, so basically every time I mean they drink as well, but not nearly as much or as very different brands as I do. So I always try to pair something when I go somewhere, and I'm like, you know what, Tony would like this, Jim would like this. Then I make sure that we do a video on the bottle that I thought you would like, just to see what you bring from this. I haven't had this either myself. This one. I've had the black one. It's ridiculously good. This one is almost where that black one was, the cask one, but I don't know. I would almost, I still want that cask bottle when I find it. So for me with the ice, scent-wise, it toned it down a little. Oh yeah, much lighter, much sweeter. You can almost pull, wow, it's almost like a citrus in here now. It left all the ethanol's gone. You could put your nose in this glass and it wouldn't burn you up. A little like allspice maybe or something. Oh, yeah. Baking those, spice kind of maybe. Those little thingies that stick in the ham. Those little spiky things. Yeah, something like that. Huh. This smells good. Oh wow. Wow, that clears everything up. Okay. So now it's like very, very citrusy vanilla yeah. with a, yeah, it's very, very orange citrus vanilla yeah, with a piece of ice. Big maple on the end there. Oh yeah. Very, very sweet. I like it. I actually really, really like this too on the ice, on the rocks too. It's great. It's, TJ, go throw this in my car. <laughs> Sorry, man. I'm taking that one home. <laughs> <laughs> Good luck finding another one because I've only ever seen it twice. <laughs> yeah. no, so but my opinion, Lost Monarch. This, this was definitely what I picked to put oh. on Tony's list. I'm like, Tony has to do this with me because I know he's going to like this. Two thumbs up for me. Right? So if he goes to the store and he sees this bottle, that's in his um, cart. I'm that's buying it. Me, personally, honestly, I mean, I already have a bottle here, so obviously I won't be going to buy another one anytime soon. But if I did go to the store, I would definitely buy this. And I probably would buy the red and the green, too, just to see. And if I do ever see the black, obviously it's already in my cart because it's, yeah, I mean, like, ridiculous. Definitely. Um, I see it. It's getting picked up. And... I'm sure you could see in the video, like, Bottle just cool. that that label Label is freaking awesome. And it has this little saying on here that I really liked. In every walk with nature, one receives far more than he seeks. Mm -hmm. Like. It's pretty deep. Yeah. It's pretty deep. Like, that is just freaking awesome. All right? Dude, it's a cool brand, man. They have all kinds of cool yeah. bottles. I, I, I don't see them very often, but if I do ask for them at the liquor store, they'll save them for me at the liquor yeah. store. So we're so, good. I can get them. Redwood Empire. Great job. Great. Hell yeah. Absolutely. But I'm going to tell, I'll, I'll tell you what, I'm going to leave one more thing before I close this down because I feel like there is a rye that I want you to try. I haven't had it, but I've heard fantastic things about it. And will it, or no, blackened as a green rye bottle. Really? I feel like that's right up your wheelhouse. I've been looking for it for you, but I can't find it. So if you do see it, yeah, if I see it's it. this bottle. Yeah, I with see green. that. I see that. This everywhere. is all green, though. Green, green. I feel like that's going to be up your alley. So, that's the one for you to look for. You guys out at home, let me know what you're drinking, because I want to know what you're drinking, because I want to try it. We'll do a video on it, see what we think of it, see how it compares to what you thought of it. Super cool. But, like we tell you in every video, I hope you're drinking while you're watching us, because if not, that's just kind of, you know. Hopefully, we're telling you what to buy. Go get this. Like, super cool. Yeah. You can find it. But, Hopefully, your palate's similar to ours. Hell yeah. Don't drink and drive. Get home safe. Call TJ. Call your mom. Call your brother. Call your sister. Whoever. Get home. Do that. And then make sure you like us, share, subscribe on YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, and TikToks all day long. Cleveland on the rocks. Boom. See ya. See ya.